I'm back guys with another cruise ship chase. Here we go! Well actually, here we are. I had a guy came up to me just as I took off, um, couldn't stop talking, he was with me for the whole flight, I couldn't believe it, do you know what I mean, this man would not let me alone, he was like a dog with a bone, you know what I'm saying, I mean it came very close to Thor having to get his hammer out and it was almost hammer time, but no, no, I'm a nice guy, I stood and chatted with this fella, but he put me off my game completely, but let me tell you peoples, just before I took off, I was like near this metal thing, so I've taken Mavic off and it's gone all crazy in the app, magnetic interference, Da -da -da, restart the drone, da -da -da -da, had to land it, restart it, and I'm sure it, it wasn't quite right during the cruise ship chase, and what with the man that just would not leave me alone, it, it's not the best, there's a couple of um, gimbal shakes throughout it, but um, anyway, check it out, and let me know what you think. Here we have the Queen Elizabeth and uh, absolutely beautiful ship. It was built in 2010. Its gross tonnage is 90,901 and it sails under the flag of Bermuda. Uh, its dead weight is 7,685 tonnes. Its length and breadth is its length is 294 metres by 36 metres wide. That's one big badass ship. Check it out. It's the Queen Elizabeth. You know what I'm saying, homies? Check out the after the ship and um, coming down the side now. Well, I've got a confession to make. Generally, in all of my videos, all you hear me talk about is litchy, litchy, litchy. Um, I read on a few forums. We all know that DJI Go 4 works better with Apple. So I had a bit of a deal on an iPhone 6 Plus and um, managed to get a DJI Go 4 uh, 4.0.8 uh, from the App Store. Had to use a program called Charles Proxy where you change the um, version number that you want and download it through iTunes. It was a bit of a pickle to do, but um, I managed to get it done in the end. But um, faultless DJI on Apple just didn't um, disconnect once, didn't crash, just worked beautifully as it should. Um, so I'm really happy with it. So it's my dedicated device now, my iPhone 6 Plus. You know what I'm saying? It's amazing. <laughs> front of the uh, Queen Elizabeth, absolutely beautiful shots, flying the Mavi backwards, that's right, I did say Mavi, not Mavi, I like to call it Mavi, I've got a little bit of a pet name for it, you know the Mavi, um, it's like my bro, you know what I'm saying. Having a look at the top of the ship now, um, not well, there's a couple of people up on top deck, but uh, it's quite chilly. It has been raining, obviously, it wasn't raining when I flew, um, Avi. 
I'm gonna call him Matt. I'm gonna call him Mavic actually. You know what I mean? I don't wanna let you lot into too much of my personal relationship with Mavic. But anyway, there's one pull up the front, and then there's the second pull towards the uh, stern of the ship. And um, yeah, she looks lovely. Absolutely beautiful vessel. Shame it wasn't sunny for all the passengers. <laughs> And that's it for this one guys, um, swing the Mavic round and it's the long fly home. I hope you've enjoyed it, it was touch and go whether or not um, I was going to actually film it because of the rain but the Lord shone down on me, you know what I'm saying? Brothers and sisters let me hear you say it, praise the Lord! And uh, I'll catch you on the next one and peace out! <laughs>